I consider myself an intuitive astrologer. I learned astrology backwards. Um, I have been doing what's called soul plan readings for most of my career as an intuitive. It's something that was divinely downloaded to me at a certain point in my path. And I've had the ability for a while to, through my clairvoyance, be able to look into people's life plans in this lifetime and also look at soul contracts, what happened between people in other lifetimes that is still relevant in the relationship in, this, in the current lifetime, and just in general, what sorts of experiences people had in other lifetimes, whether they were a, sh a shaman or you know in a Buddhist temple or a pirate or uh, a jester or whatever. So what I started doing was I'd always had a fascination with astrology. And at a certain point, people, you know, my clients were asking me like, how does this relate to my natal chart? And at first I was like, you know, I don't really know. I haven't studied this all that much. And I started just looking at people's charts kind of in the moment as I was doing these readings and seeing the correlations between what I was seeing and what I was seeing in the chart. So I really learned astrology backwards. I learned it through the practical application of it. And I still kind of lean on that to this day, although I've done a lot of study over the last few years to really uh, you know, learn astrology the right way, let's say. I still, when I'm you know, in practice doing a reading, I am feeling into the chart. I'm feeling into, okay, here's their node, here are the planets around their node, here's the house that you know this node of the planets are in. What were these past lives? You know, I see this, you know, I see Saturn here, or, or I see Mars or Venus here. Who are these people? Who were you in a past life that has had these experiences that relate to these planets? So I consider myself an intuitive astrologer, which um, I think is not all that common. I think there's more now than ever before. Um, but I think that's what I bring to the table.